Ramadan, 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 Ramadan. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. My dear brothers and sisters, I hope you all are well, inshallah. If it's your first time on our channel, please make sure to subscribe and share. Alhamdulillah, we have entered the holy month of Ramadan. The first 10 days of Rahmah or blessings have started. We will be posting a video every other days of Ramadan. In the first 10 days, we will be talking about five of the important blessings of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala with you all, inshallah. I hope you will enjoy. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has bestowed countless blessings upon us. The most important and greatest blessing sent by Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is our Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. He has enriched us with the gift of sight and hearing, intellect, health, wealth and family. He has even created everything in the universe for us. The sun, the moon, the heavens and the earth and many countless things. As the Quran states in Surah Nahal, verse number 18. If you tried to number Allah's blessings, you could never count them. However, our Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam was the greatest among all the blessings of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala as stated in Quran Surah Anbiya verse number 107 And we have not sent you O Prophet, accept as a mercy to the world. Allah sent his Prophet as a result of the supplication of the Prophet Ibrahim وسلم, and his son Ismail Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala said in Surah Baqarah verse number 129 رَبَّنَا وَبَعَثْ فِيهِمْ رَسُولًا مِّنْهُمْ يَتْلُو عَلَيْهِمْ آيَاتِكَ وَيُعَلِّمُهُمُ الْكِتَابَ وَالْحِكْمَةَ وَيُزَكِّيهِمْ إِنَّكَ أَنْتَ الْعَزِيزُ الْحَكِيمُ O oh, our Lord, raise among them a great messenger from among themselves, who may recite to them your messages and teach them the book, the Quran, and wisdom, and may purify them. Indeed, you are almighty, the all-wise. Once we will get any blessings from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, what do we need to do? Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala mentioned in Surah Yunus, verse number 58. O Prophet, say, in Allah's grace and mercy, let them rejoice. That is far better than whatever wealth they gathered. 
So, once you will get any kind of blessings from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, we need to be grateful to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Also, rejoice and be happy.